a.m. I couldn't fall asleep again. Been overthinking. What's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Chandala. So basically, I just reached Hong Kong market right now and currently in the indoor shopping mall building because I have an appointment for vaccine with Indo Beauty Spa. So just heading there right now. Let's get on the lift. <laughs> Or is it maybe second? How much stamina I have? Like I literally walked just a teeny weeny bit, not even like 500 meters, and I'm like panting severely. Oh my god, I really need to work out. So let's just wait and see if this is the one. No, it doesn't. So maybe the third floor. So let's try this. Yes, this is the one. Let's enter. Just got done with my threading and oh my god I'm so sensitive to pain it hurts so badly and it's all red all across so now let's go for a waxing I just got done with my waxing and it was like so painful oh my god but so glad that it's over and I feel like super clean and I'm not just going to head to the bank because I have to like reapply my credit card I think it's like 150 right now so let me go and do that and then maybe if time permits go for a pedicure we'll see about that so yeah let's get going let me just change up first I'm just walking towards the bank which is right here and a lot of traffic on the road just going to cross through that terminal pedestrian lane such a nice lovely day and it's not too chilly today also so let's cross the road now thank you okay so you're finally here at bank of Bhutan let's get our work done out of the bank got my work done uh, set up a new fixed deposit account but for my credit card replacement I need to get a witness and stick a legal stamp oh my lord so anywho guys let's head and do other official works at other offices <laughs> most probably I think I'll just take a cab because I have to go to Thai consulate so let's get going taxi taxi there's one here oh taxi perfect Oh, I'm in Thai consulate. You get me? I just don't know. Let's be here on the fourth floor. OMG. Let's walk. So we just got done from the Royal Thai Consulate and just submitted my passports as well for my flight. So basically now I'm just going to head to town. I need a witness and legal stamp to reapply for my credit card which sucks because the bank is about to close and it's supposed to be getting tomorrow so I really don't know what's going to happen but anywho firstly let's have lunch because I'm like so hungry but I don't know where to eat like seriously no idea and I doubt this lift is working so anywho guys most probably I'll just look for a place to eat or just take away and then head home because uh, my helper will be there today cleaning the house so I'll just go and see around if I can think of any Hi guys, so I just came to Good Wives to grab some burger and fries like super hungry to that point where I don't even care that I'm eating alone I'm just going to gobble it up and then get back to my work and resume it all so hungry, just waiting thank you thank you it's eat so hungry it's so hungry right now So we're just waiting in the car right now. Seven's gone out to get some pain. I had like an eventful day today to be quite honest. But then I'm just so like upset and unhappy because I couldn't submit my bank form. And tomorrow's the weekend. So I can do it only on Monday. So that's a issue. Apart from that, I got my waxing done. My threading done. 
and then I submitted my passports to the Thai consulate and I even met my friends so basically a lot of ticked off items on the list so for now let's just wait 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 and yeah let's just wait maybe I'll make some dinner today I don't know I feel like making chicken beans fry and dal but we'll see how the situation is like the weather's too cold to cook anything basically but we'll just see <laughs> yes, good morning good morning <laughs> so I just got ready actually I'm planning to go to this place in Taba I guess it's Taba and it's located inside Nima High School Auditorium so basically they have a huge variety of goods I think it's from China so I just checked the page on Instagram and found some items quite delightful so I was going to go there and see what all they have and because basically I need to look for a gift to give someone so hopefully I get something good so let's head there oh wow it has a two opening barbecue station barbecue boilers nice containers I didn't, I didn't notice this one. This is so gorgeous. I'm going to go with this one. This has like a divider back. I mean, up and down, so you can cook the two different selections, and you can grill some meat or veggies here. Perfect. This one is way better. So currently, just loading the car. This one is in. And this one in. Hi guys, so I just got back home right now, super tired, the weather outside is pretty sultry and it's making me feel really drowsy, especially after a heavy lunch. We went to eat at Doji Troze, which is located in like Zangtuperle building, even though like the place looks a tad bit uh, dingy, but the food is like really good, next level, you should, guys should definitely try it out. And for today, I'm just going to end my vlog here, because I'm just going to go and now crash on my bed while watching some Shark Tank. So thank you so much guys for tuning in. Also, did you guys watch the recent episode of Big Boss? My heart like really went out to Charlene. I felt so bad for him. It's like just imagine you're locked up in the house for over 100 days and you have no friend basically treated as an outcast and then like there's a lot of groupism happening. It's just so sad and heartbreaking. So I am team Charlene for now. I hope he can make it through and come out of it stronger and yeah that's pretty much it guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like share subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll see you in the next video bye bye so i can't stand the thought of you even from your point of view you know what you did and you despise yourself